Oh my fucking god. Well, maybe that was a little too hard. <laughs> if you know Tesla, you've probably seen the company's designer smashing a Tesla Cybertruck's supposedly unbreakable windows with a steel ball. The stunt was supposed to prove how strong the glass on the truck was, but unfortunately backfired when cracks appeared on the window, not once, but twice. According to Elon Musk, We think what happened was that sledgehammer hit the door and there's not even a dent. It's cool, but we think that that cracked the corner of the glass at the bottom. Once you crack the corner of the glass, then it's game over. So what glass would have stood up to all that abuse? Let's take a dive into Tesla's armored glass and several of the other strongest glasses in the world, some of which are even stronger than steel. The glass you come across daily, like that used in the windows of your home, isn't likely anything too special. The most common type of glass is tempered, which fractures into small, relatively harmless pieces rather than jagged shards. It is commonly used in shower doors, vehicle windows, and architectural features. Laminated glass is another commonly used type of glass. This type of glass is made from two sheets of glass bonded together with an interlayer. This produces a spider web on impact instead of shattering into pieces. It is often used in vehicle windshields, storefronts, windows, and other architectural features. You also won't find the world's strongest glass in your cell phone. Although Corning's latest Gorilla Glass Victus for phones can survive a six-foot drop and avoid scratches better than any previous iteration from the company. Of course, it all depends on how you drop your phone. The chemically strengthened glass cover is designed to be light, but still isn't perfect. Now, think about something a lot stronger. One thing that might come to mind is bulletproof glass. Also known as ballistic glass, this material is strong, but can still be penetrated by bullets, despite the name. It's typically made by layering a polycarbonate material between pieces of ordinary glass. The more layers, the more protection. The polycarbonate layers allow the glass to absorb the bullet's energy. Bulletproof glass, as rated by the Underwriters Laboratory, offers different levels of protection, ranging from level 1, which can sustain three 9mm bullets at a minimum velocity of 1175 feet per second, to level 8, which can withstand at least five shots from a 7.62mm rifle. The higher levels tend to be very heavy and require specialized window frames. The glass in the Cybertruck you saw earlier is reportedly a type of bulletproof glass, but there's some mystery surrounding the exact composition of the material. Around 2016, Tesla established its Tesla Glass program, which was led by a former Apple materials engineer. Tesla uses a lot of glass in its vehicles, from panoramic roofs to windows and in-vehicle displays. Tesla's Model Y now comes with a laminated double-pane glass in its driver and passenger side front door windows. The latest Model 3 also comes with these features. However, Tesla has also taken their glass game a step further. The company's Tesla Armor Glass, which we saw in the Cybertruck demonstration, is described as an ultra-strong glass and polymer-layered composite that can absorb and redirect impact force. Musk has referred to the glass as a transparent metal, but other than that, the exact engineering behind the material remains a mystery. Some theorize that the material may be similar to Allon, Sometimes referred to as transparent aluminum, Alon is capable of stopping a .50 Browning machine gun armor-piercing round with just 1.6 inches of thickness, as compared to the 3.7 inches of traditional laminate glass needed to stop this round. The material is a ceramic made up of aluminum, oxygen, and nitrogen, which are compressed and baked at high temperatures and pressures. Once polished, Alon resembles glass. It's much lighter and thinner than traditional bulletproof glass. Alon itself is being considered for use in the International Space Station, among other space vehicles. 
Unfortunately, Alon is incredibly expensive. It costs around $10 to $15 per square inch, compared to around $0.17 to $0.69 cents per square inch for traditional bulletproof glass. In 2011, researchers from Caltech and the Department of Energy's Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory unveiled a metallic glass that was stronger and tougher than steel. In fact, it beat out any other known material. The shatterproof glass was made from palladium with small fractions of other metalloids, including phosphorus, silicon, silver, and germanium. When combined, these elements resulted in a material that was extremely flexible and resisted shattering. A glass that's stronger than steel could be used to make dental implants, nuclear pressure vessels, or used in aerospace components, especially with new metallic glass innovations. For example, in 2021, a group from the Yale School of Engineering and Applied Science developed a method to increase the ductility of metallic glasses. Ethan Lund, co-author of the paper, believes this makes them a promising option in the generation of new engineering materials. Glass is all around us. It protects us from the elements when we travel in planes, trains, and cars. It allows those with poor vision to see better, and it's a key component in our urban architecture. With ongoing developments, this versatile material may even be able to someday stand up to a steel ball thrown by Elon Musk. <laughs>